One renewable energy sources is wind-driven electric stations. Air motional energy is used for rotation of electric generator rotor. Such electric stations have already spread and their share in generations is more and more increasing year by year. Most of all windmills are produced according to the design with the so-called cross-axis of rotation. It's parallel to wind stream. It's a classical construction resembling a windmill. There also exists a principally different type, wind power generators with vertical axis of rotation. It is perpendicular to air stream. A Frenchman, Georges Darion, offered such a rotor in 1931, and now this device is of great demand. Darion rotor is a symmetrical construction of several aerodynamic wind impellers. Axis of rotation is, as it has been already said, vertical. These wings have a form of wing from a cross-sectional view. Therefore, when they get into air stream, they undergo influence of lifting force. Its magnitude depends on the angle between the speed vector of the stream and instantaneous speed of a wing. And for vector of instantaneous speed of a wing, repeatedly changes during the process of rotor rotation. Moment of force developing by the rotor will be changeable too. Thus, at any moment, opposite impellers are influenced with lifting forces, directed in such a manner that they are summarized and start rotation of a spindle. Such devices can be of different forms, delta, Y or diamond shaped, for example. Wings of propeller should be lightweight, but at the same time rather strong. The rear rotor has a set of advantages in comparison with propeller aggregates. The most important is that it isn't necessary to make orientation downwind. It is rotated under any air direction. Moreover, such a generator is simple in exploitation and repair, more effective, for maximum energy is reached with a wider range of wind speed. They make less noise in contrast to propel a unit, producing sound in all directions. Vectors of sound transmissions of the rear rotor are up and down directed. And finally, they are less harmful to animals. Wind energy efficiency of both constructions is approximately equal, but it has a disadvantage, a little bit lower self-starting ability. To start a rotation, it is required heavy wind or external impulse. One more problem is reliability of the construction under high speed of rotation. Now, wind generators based on their real construction are used in many countries, in the USA, Canada and the Netherlands. The biggest rotor is a rotor, VAWT in Great Britain, that produces energy higher than 130 kilowatt.